My friends, welcome to Distant Worlds Universe. We're playing as the core. Um, last time at the end, we upgraded all of the designs. That means we're going to have the fantastic, fantastic means to um, give the orders again to a Red Row Fit. Now, since my exploration ships are not doing as much, I uh, might as just well just go and do everything so let's retrofit you to the new design costing us eleven and a half thousand construction yards can i retrofit you from here to a medium no we cannot which is uh, highly unfortunate um the moon itself we cannot retrofit if only that was possible i would have tried it defensive bases we don't exploration ships Explore, explore, refuel, all of that. Well, that's great. Why don't you go and retrofit freighters? That's not my thing. Military ships, we did mining stations. Let's go on roll, gas mining. Although they are on auto upgrade, so I'm interesting in seeing if they do. So if I were to say retrofit, it would be the Mark IV. Let's select... You're on the Mark II. Mark II, yeah. So they're not doing that automatically. That is quite a shame. Let's do retrofit. And we're just helping these guys out because so well. Hey, we changed something. We don't need uh, them to pay that all the time. Monitoring stations, we don't have. Passenger ships, other bases, research stations. This one is quite important. Energy. High tech. And weapons, there we go, it's going to cost us a lot, but I think it's well worth it. We don't have resource bases, resupply space, but troop transports we don't have. Damaged ships, do we have damaged ships? Low on fuel, I bet, but that's about all that we want to be doing. Um, we could consider, let's unpause, uh, let's, um, we could consider increasing the fleet. Though, is that really necessary right now? He has completed his mission. That's cool. You go retrofit. Let's uh, make sure you got more of everything. Now, you'll see that the research is going to be dropping down. I wonder what it will do to uh, these stats. Now, before I forget, there is one base that I need to do by hand. A poor navigator. I really should shoot these fellas. Um, luckily for us, we have completed the research into point defense. Of course, now that happens once I did the upgrade, but we'll, uh, we'll do that later. Let's get the small spaceport retrofit into the medium spaceport. So that will start happening. We'll have more building slots, less ships waiting, which is definitely a good thing. There's more than three waiting right now. Everything is popping back in, of course. Look at all of these. They're all heading their way. He's still undergoing there. Now, I think by changing the uh, the ships and the engines, as well as some of the fuel, some of our ships can now go a bit further. And if that is, of course, the case, then I do want to build more exploration ships. Now, I don't have to worry about the uh, exploration task, even though... It is wonderful. It really is an amazing feature. Uh, but I am too much of a goofball to actually <laughs> get that one going. Uh, all retrofitting. All heading back. We are on four times the speed. And hopefully by getting more exploration and getting more construction, we are going to have... Okay, we got shortages. Now this is going to be the case to our private sector what kind of so uh, we got a shortage of let's go into messages helium and steel helium steel and lead helium steel steel helium steel okay so we'll be focusing on helium steel and lead uh, let's see, you are being worked on. Let's zoom out a bit. 
helium, steel and lead most likely. Yeah, steel and lead. So all of the mining stations do not have enough inventory to actually upgrade and request for fueling, which is great. We are lacking everything. Now the private sector is probably going to retrofit themselves. Hopefully they are smart enough to bring in uh, cargo first before doing anything. So the retrofit of the base, the spaceport, has been going to a medium spaceport. Look at all of these docked. All of these docked. Fighters. Building. Building, and it's actually retrofitting. Damn, that's huge. That is absolutely huge. Let's go to state ships. Construction ship. Let's do edit. And skill 10? Whoa! No, uh, definitely not. Let's skill you back. Can we do it percentage? And skill you all the way to 50. Save. Now, this should, I think. Change the amazing size. And now they're starting to look like they could actually fit in one of these stations. Which is uh, what we would like. Um, construction ship. Anyone waiting? No mission. So, let's pause here. No mission. That's great. Let us do... Helium. Uh, it's not the best, but hey, it is helium, right? What am I complaining about? Let's take a look at the range. Yes, that's brilliant. You, no mission, and you got a long ass way to go. So, explore in H5. Everything is now retrofitted, and I'd say we could definitely increase the amount of ships. Maybe like uh, one, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and we got like five or six. Two more? No. I'd say let's go to make four more. Construction yard. And I want you to make four more exploration ships. And let us make, we'll select the planet. We'll make the construction ships. How many do we have? I think we have four. Let's make two more. Uh, to speed things up, of course. That would be ten. This would be six. I'm well okay with six. Um, commission was completed. So, retrofit. These are being built. So, they will tell you if they don't require retrofitting. It's already retrofitted, they will tell you. So, that's really nice. And then, most of them are awaiting. The construction chair scheme has been completed. That means he will have no mission in a second. Oh, wait a minute. Some are, are on automatic. I don't like that. Please do not be... Auto Why can I not turn this off? I hate automatic. Go away. Construction yard, you are on. Although, I don't think that actually works, but hey, that's fine. You can try. Exploration ship. Don't be automatic, please. Anything else? That would be automated. No. So, one is building somewhere. And I might not want to have it there. Oh, that's annoying. Cheerful scheme has been completed. You are building the uh, the weapons research. Oh, that's great. That's that's a fantastic job. You are doing a wonderful, wonderful thing. Construction ship has uh, managed to fulfill its mission. Let's upgrade. Yeah, man, the range is, is gorgeous. 
So let's take a quick look at home defense. Should almost be a sector as well. Exploration ship has been done. And they are been done. Okay. So explore I5. And you go over here. We can now reach that, hopefully. And you go over here. Anyone else not doing exploration? Engineers have completed the research in colonization. Oh, fantastic. I like that a lot. Uh, you're going over here. Because we can now start work on our colonization ship. And I'm going to be very sorry for you guys. Because I will be making our colonization ship. It's not going to be fancy. It doesn't need to be. The ship mo most likely will. Well. It, it's designed to stop existing after a certain mission. So yeah. No need to do it too complicated. Let us go and do. I'm um, state ship. Let's do copy as new, whatever. Get everything out. So much going on. Um, let's see. What would be a very nice design for colonization? I think this, this sword-like construction. Colonization. Colonizer. And you can be large. You, you, yeah, you can be large. Standoff? I don't think so. Let's evade. Evade. Uh, invasion. Do not invade. And immediately, enemy sighted. There you go. Just get out. Get out when you can. Uh, armor. And the 250 like our regular ships. Uh, we need a warp field bubble. Reactors will do later. We'll add 500 of those. We don't need weapons. We could add the auto cannons. But why would we? He will be evading as soon as he sees enemies. Let's add 15 of you. 10 of you. We might even go to 20. Just to make it faster. We need this. Don't need this. Construction. Power. Fuel. We do need. I want to get you up to probably 15 to get a good range. We need to get well, cargo. Do we need cargo? Colonizer modules. No, we do not need cargo. Docking base. We don't need. Uh, proximity sensor. I would really like that. Um, because that will be like for defensive purposes, I would say. Uh, why do I keep on adding five? One is more than enough. Add you. Don't need all of these. Construction yard. Habitability life and reactor core. I think this is more than enough. I don't think we need to add anything else except for you. And we have to be careful not to go over our design. So let's add this. 1250. It has a good range. It is a slow acceleration. But what can we do about that? Colonization module. So I would need another one. And I don't think we can. Actually we can. But that would make our ship extremely expensive. If I can get rid of some things to make it not need another one, I would be extremely happy about that. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Damn. 12. Oof. What can we get rid of? Decrease the engines. And decrease the uh, movement. We don't need to, to turn fast. We just want it to go and just do your thing. We can now. I don't want to remove those. The colony range is one. Which is enough for now. We are lacking power still. So we can get rid of one. kind of feel we might want to remove some more movement. Are we not able to do this? 
Let's see. Add less. Oh, damn. The range is increasing, so we could lower that. Let's just make sure that we get, keep less. We don't necessarily need this much. So let's bring that down. Oh, there we go. It's gone. It is gone, and I love it. So it's back. <laughs> oh, you bastard. Um, and let's just add a bunch until it starts complaining. Like there. And there we go. 600, our colony ship. With one module, it has... Well, it's not the fastest. Uh, it's definitely not the fastest. But here we go, we got one. That means we have the potential colony. That is... Let's see. There you go, potential... Resort locations. There's mining locations. I don't need that. Potential colonies. So go ahead and um, colonize this planet in the name of the core. The quality is quite nice. The size is a bit low and it has some very, very nice materials on it. So that is very, very gorgeous. So the, some of the ships are still retrofitting, which is a shame. It shows you how big our problem is especially with the uh, the helium the lead and the steel things it's a bit of a shame yes advanced construction is almost done yeah I'll, I'll wait until we get some more things to put up like energy collections on the station and i want to increase maneuvering engines warp field and space reactor So if we find, oh there we go, another refueling station, which is great. If we find the pirates, I'd say it's going to be a, a wonderful time, because we'll have a bit of a combat just taking them out. Just making sure they will never, never come contact us again for the rest of their lives. Which is the best thing ever. What is it that we want to be boosting? Shipboarding is being done, I believe. Can we boost you? No, we cannot. Advanced construction? Yes, we can. So let's do that. Targeting. And do that as well. As much as we can boost, the better. Especially because we are not able to trade with other species. So, yeah. I would really like to get that underway. One, two, three, four are still trying to retrofit. So let's uh, select you. And some are now being done. There we go. We have completed the research in enhanced construction. Which is great. Now we're going to make sure that we are going to get that wonder. Building speed with 100. That's just pure awesomeness. Ah. Oh. No, go away. I don't care who you are, what you do, and whatever it is that you think you can. I don't need you, pirate. With your one ship and 30 firepower. And my military strength being a bit higher. I can't wait until we can actually build big-ass stations. Now, that would be, man, that would be so cool. So st we're still building up the standard fighter base as well. Let's take a quick look at research. Now, this is going to be down. Look at this. The actual output has increased, um, which is r quite odd, since the uh, only this one, the Endeavor, still has um, research slots on it. So why? Uh, do do let me know. Why is my research now higher? Is it scaling up? What is, what's the, the, the thing with it? Because I will add a million research in all of the station if I would get like 600k in each thing. Without a question I would do it, no matter the cost. 
because it will eventually just get me really in um, into the profits because we'll get a so much uh, research. So yeah, the waiting game is starting. Pirates offer protection. No way, man. We don't need your protection, you need ours. Are you going to be able to do a thing? Hey, there we go, finally good news. Rick Ross has leveled up and is now giving us a research stack of plus 14. Well met, sir, well met. Let's get all of that going. I wish there was like a plus 8 at the moment. Once we start meeting other empires, we are going to be playing slower. I do wonder how fast my ships get out now. I could probably get these ships to be higher. And they haven't all been retrofitted. Look at that, no shields. And I don't care, but we're getting plus 17 from the private sector. Transport ships, cool. There's a bit of, le as soon as you select a ship, actually no, as soon as you're in there, there's a bit of lag, I don't know why. Uh, colonizer has been completed, so the colonization ship is going to be on its way. Awesome, there it goes. It's lined over all, all the way up there. So that means we'll have to make a thing called a... Um, it's not really called a thing though, it's a station that will just boost the medical and recreational purposes of a planet, just to give it an additional boost. So, first things first, no mission, we'll work on that. No mission, okay. You, I want you to help in this sector. Anyone else? Uh, refueling? So all of these have been retrofitted. And now let's go into let. Uh, that's a good amount. Let's send you over there. And here is gold, lead, and steel. So that's actually a no-brainer. Let's just send them out. And with that done, I thank you so much for watching. And I hope you have enjoyed yourself. I know I do. And I can't wait until we can get our hands on some juicy, juicy aliens. So we can actually just kill them off. Um, 2%? Yeah, that's not. So we'll bring you down again. Hopefully that will increase the growth. And uh, next time, once the colony is done, we're going to be creating a small station. And just adding the recreational and medical on it. Because I don't think it is colony-wide. It, um, it is it is colony-wide. It's not galaxy-wide or uh, system-wide. Which is a bit of a shame. So, you are doing a fantastic job. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you next time. Goodbye.